ranking and high intensity action are to the fore as table tennis and para table tennis provide 11 days of edge of your seat action at Birmingham's National Exhibition Centre. The basics. The aim of the game is to hit the ball over the net into your opponent's half in such a way that they fail to return it. First pass! Play begins with a serve which must bounce first on the server's side of the net. Clear the net and then bounce on the opponent's side. If the serve clips the net but lands in, it's given as a let and the point is replayed. A player scores a point when their opponent misses the table. And that seals it. Allows the ball to bounce twice or sends it into the net. The stats. A table tennis table is 1.525 metres wide by 2.74 metres long and 76 centimetres high. The net, which divides the table equally in two, is 15.25 centimetres high. The ball is 40 millimetres in diameter and weighs only 2.7 grams. Its lightweight enables players to use a variety of spins and to reach speeds in excess of 50 miles per hour. Oh, beautiful point. Competition format. There are 11 gold medals up for grabs at Birmingham 2022. Men's and women's singles and doubles. Mixed doubles. And men's and women's team competitions. There it is. And for the first time in Commonwealth Games history, para-table tennis athletes will compete in four singles events, with two classification groups for men and two for women. No, she's just too good, isn't she? In singles, the top 16 ranked players proceed directly to the 32 place main draw. The remaining athletes compete in a round robin format for the right to advance to the main draw, which is a straight knockout format, and all matches are the best of seven games. The doubles event is a straight knockout competition where all matches are best of five games. The team competition begins with a group stage, with countries battling to be one of eight teams that advance to the knockout phase. In the team event, each team of three players will play one doubles match and up to four singles matches. All matches are best of five games. Each para-table tennis event features two groups of four athletes. The top two from each group advance to the semi-final. All matches are best of five games. Key shots. As well as the serve, there are two other principal strokes, the forehand and the backhand. They can be further categorised into several attacking and defensive shots, such as topspin, an attacking shot where the racket brushes the back of the ball, resulting in a large amount of topspin which causes the ball to dip before bouncing and accelerate upwards from the bounce. Smash. This is also an attacking shot. That's wonderful play. The aim is to get the ball to move so quickly that the opponent cannot return it. That is brilliant. This is done with a large backswing and quick acceleration. Oh, blue off the table. Chop. A defensive shot that uses backspin so the bottom half of the ball rotates away from the player. This is achieved by striking the base of the ball with a downward movement. Table tennis is a test of agility, hand-eye coordination and lightning reflexes. Oh, Who will play their way to Commonwealth glory? It's glorious goal for the English